jack up your truck. Put in your jack stands. Harbor Freight. Get your skateboard. Also, Harbor Freight. Get your tools. Not Harbor Freight. Take your wheel off. Whoops. Spray that. Let it sit. Pop these guys off for the uh, brake caliper. 10 millimeter Allen key. Take them out. This one goes on the top. And, oh, will it come? This one with the rubber goes on the bottom. So don't get those mixed up. Set those aside. We'll clean them later. Now that we got our caliper off, hung out of the way, grab this in a 21 socket, stick it on there, and let her eat. Can't use it on the top, so we're going to have to use our big boy muscles and a breaker bar because it's 170 foot pounds of torque. So good luck. Go ahead, take this off. Go ahead, pull out your old ones, put in your new ones, and then take your pads, stick them in there. One and two. Go ahead and get your other one, stick that in there. Go ahead, take your wrench, wedge it on the floor, grab it with your feet, stick your uh, T30 torch bit in there. Don't strip it like you stripped the other side. Aha, got it. Take this off. Don't need that where we're going sell that on Facebook marketplace with our pads take this put it on this pull the trigger clean all that up new rotors on go ahead seat it make sure it's all good to go make sure it's tighten check that and then blast it with the one and only brake cleaner go ahead put your bracket back on put this on there Adjust that to 170 and put some torque on it. And then taking an old brake pad, caliper, and a clamp here. Go ahead and uh, put those little pistons back where they belong. Once you get your piston squeezed back into your caliper, go ahead and take you a dollop of daisy and uh, just hit your contact patches where the caliper touches the uh, brake pad here. Oh, and by the way, uh do what you want but i see some people coming over here painting up their uh pads with caliper grease like old bob ross uh i'm not into arts and crafts so uh i figured just do you know kind of the minimum parts where the caliper touches the pad that way you don't have a big mess because big messes uh collect a lot of uh, road grime and dust and dirt and everything else so uh i don't like messes so do what you like but that's just my two cents on it Get your caliper seated back on there. Go ahead and uh, take your pin. Remember which one goes where. Smooth goes in the top. Go ahead and get that in there. By the way, cleaned it real good. Put some caliper grease on there real liberally, just like old Joe Biden. And uh, we're just going to go ahead and work her on there. And then uh, get our bottom one with the rubber and stick that in. All right, we got them in there. We got our torque wrench on here. Going to go ahead and just torque her down until it snaps off inside the caliper. Just just kidding, guys. It's uh, 70, 74 pounds. So don't, don't do that. 74 pounds is what you need. Don't forget your covers. Go ahead and just uh, pop them little guys back in there. There's a uh, little tiny groove. You can kind of see it. Just play with it. Crawl up in your truck. Watch your pedal go all the way to the floor. Give it a couple good pumps until it feels nice and firm set the truck off and then come out here take a look make sure uh, everything looks good on your brake line make sure nothing got uh ripped bent torn no leaks after uh, dangling your caliper uh make sure that uh everything still spins freely kind of look at your uh, calipers there or your uh yeah your pistons make sure they look good on the brake pads both sides and uh sheet all you gotta do is put the wheels back on now Cha.
Don't forget to torque to 140. All right, so we just wrapped up here. Appreciate y'all watching. Hope you uh, found it informative and uh, absolute serious all the way through because that's all I'm about is serious stuff. So anyhow, um, I'm not going to include how to uh, veg your uh, brakes just because it's kind of different for, uh, for every manufacturer in the type of uh, pad that it is. So I'll let you guys do a little bit of research on your own and figure it out. Uh, if you can't, just comment below and I'll be able to point you in the right direction. But anyways, I appreciate y'all watching and uh, yeah, hope you liked it.